Hey, hello guys and welcome to another video. This is Lyakura's Moments and welcome to Lyakura's Moments Gaming channel. Here on this channel we're gonna make gaming, obviously, and small tutorials like this one. So today I'm gonna teach you, I'm gonna show you actually how you can play the Beam NG, the amazing simulation game, drive simulation crashing game, how you can play it multiplayer online. All right, so let's jump to the PC. I'm gonna share my screen with you and I'm gonna show you everything. So let's jump to the PC. All right, here if you have the game, you'll see that you don't actually have this option of multiplayer like I do right now. So this actually, this is a multiplayer mode that you can install and it will allow you to find and connect to servers. Okay, the multiplayer actually guys, is a lot of fun to play with other players and crash the cars all together and you're gonna definitely will enjoy it. Okay, so in order to download the multiplayer mode, you'll need to go to BIMMP dot com and download the client it's a big green box that you can see on the top and i'll put of course all the links in the description below so you can find it easy all right so when you download it just open it and unzip it and after you'll see the installer so click the installer after a setup will pop up you'll need just to click next and follow the procedure. You can click typical or if you wanna do something custom, it's up to you, I use the typical. So you choose after the folder we want, you want to install it. Okay, so choose the folder, click next, click install and finish. Okay, when you finish, just close everything. You don't need that anymore. So you'll see on your desktop, you have a new icon, the Beam MP Launcher. So if you wanna play multiplayer, you'll need to click on that, on Beam MP Launcher, the new one. And if you wanna play single player, you can click the old one. Next thing we need to do is to join the official Beam MP Discord server. This is because the game uses Discord to authenticate the users. So in order to play online, you'll need to join this server. And there you'll find a big actually community of BNG lovers that you can ask for any help that you may need. Usually people there on the server are very helpful and you can make also some friends there to play uh, online, right? Also, if you change any settings on your game and you wanna transfer it, uh, these settings to multiplayer, you can actually do it. If you go to your documents and find the settings, you can copy all this information there and paste it to the new installation folders on settings again. Okay, so we're done here. Let's open the Beam multiplayer so I can show you how it works. When you click on it, the launcher opened and of course it's gonna take a couple minutes to download everything and load everything. After a while, my Windows Defender pop up, so you need just to allow the access or maybe your antivirus is gonna pop up. Okay, so after that, launch the game normally and wait a bit for the game to launch. It will take some time as well. When the game opens on the main menu, you can see on the repository that you have one mode active. Before that, I didn't have any mode, didn't install any mode. So now we have one mode active. And if you go there to the modes manager, you can see that is the one that we just installed, the multiplayer, the Beam MP. From here, you can deactivate, remove it or unsubscribe like any other mode. Okay, so let's go back to the main menu to show you how it works. I'm gonna click play and now you can see a new option, the multiplayer box here. So we're gonna click on it and you'll see now that you can create a new Beam MP account. This is actually from the forum. So you can actually, if you want, you can create, you can register. I, I did it so I can log in or you can play as a guest if you don't want it. But if you want to see your name there, you can just register and have your name. And it's actually a forum that you can see there. You can find some information and support that you may need. So it's up to you. I made it. So I'm going to log in. I'm going to log in with my details. And you can see also my name here after when I logged in and I can log out if I want after. So now that we are logged in, you can see the servers here. This is all the servers. There are options to see our recent servers. We can see our favorites if we saved something. We can see the forum. This is where we logged in. So it's nothing bad there. It's just the Beam MP forum there. And of course, the direct connect. This is where you can actually connect to a specific server. I think this will be good if you try to find a server where is your friend, he can actually just send you the details. I remember this, we was doing it on Counter-Strike before, a couple of years before. <laughs> All right. 
Okay, so let's close everything here and let's join a server. Uh, let's select one of those ones here. On the top you can see there are the official BeamMP servers and below are the random ones. I play both of them, I think it's actually the same, I'm not sure the difference. So let's just click one of them and let's see how it's gonna play. Okay, here it's gonna take some time to load actually as it's downloading the map, the vehicles, it's gonna need to load everything, the forests, so many things on this game. It's actually a bit heavy for my laptop and especially on online game guys, uh, it can be very laggy. I'm not sure if it's just for me or it's just for everybody. So if you play, if you, when you play this game online, let me know also if you're lagging, how it's playing. Because I'm using a laptop here, I'm not having the best PC here. <laughs> My laptop is not the best. It's okay, it's a random. It's, it's actually good, it's Alienware, but let me know about yours, how, you're, uh, how, how is your experience with online. Okay. Okay, here when you just enter the game, uh, you're gonna be like spectacular, you're gonna just watching others to play. So you need to click the escape button here, actually go to vehicles and choose a vehicle that you want. Select one randomly or whatever you want, click spawn new or if you click even replace current, it will make the same here on the multiplayer. And here you're actually playing Beam MP online, so have fun! Alright, and as I said before guys, if you have anything to recommend about the lag here, how to fix it on the multiplayer, let me know in the comment section below. I believe many people are gonna find it very interesting as if I have this problem, other people have it as well. Other than that, enjoy the game guys and see you in the online BMMP. Alright guys, thanks for watching, I hope this video actually helped you to play the Beam NG multiplayer, so if it did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this one. So, see you in the next one. <laughs>